Hello everyone, welcome to another Kirby Turn Treatment <coughs> Extra Mode walkthrough. In the last episode, we cleared the final walking stage of a oh, dangerous dinner. In this episode, we are going to be doing the item challenge. And I probably wonder why the hell am I doing this right now? Well, I'm going to be honest, once you go through the boss stage, there's no turning back, so, uh, let's just get this out of the way. And besides, we got all the energy spheres, so hurrah, hooray! And, uh, this is your reward for getting all of them. Um, <laughs> it's a little disappointing, I'll admit, because, uh, <clears throat> I was expecting anything really epic, versus an epic game, but you just get this. So, pretty much... Uh, this area is, you pretty much have to master all the game mechanic items that you find throughout the game and they put you through this little test of balls and skills. So let's just head right into it. And, um, okay, I didn't screw up surprisingly. And look, they played old Kirby music. How fitting. I mean, such. So yeah. This is a pretty fun challenge, actually, although it's pretty difficult, actually, to admit, some parts. Because, well, yeah, just some parts. So I'll be surprised if I do this all in one try. Although, I always jinx myself in the end, and I always bought in one part. So let's hopefully, I don't screw up. Okay, good. Let's hope I don't screw up, because I always screw up in this. Well, in these challenges, at least once, because, well, I always do, so I always get sad in the end. But yeah, you pretty much have to master, like I said again, master the the shoe item, the key item, and the shooting item, whatever you call it. I forgot what it's called and such. All in one little area. Oh, this part's kind of tricky, actually. You get to time it, so... Ah, oh, crud. No! No! Ah, oh, freak. Um... Dang it, I screwed that one up. Alright, eh, whatever, um, we'll just keep on going. I'll do another round, um, round after, after knowing this, because I'm probably not getting a good score anyway, because I missed all those stuff, and this is really the easiest part of the challenge, because, well, all you do is just jump and run, and you, if you miss any stuff, then well, that's kind of sucks for you. You need to have more, better platforming skills, or maneuverability skills. Now, let's grab that. Let's go up here. Grab this, and let's go in here for another end, for a bonus area. This bonus area, you yeah, have to use a mechanic that's not even introduced to the game at all. Inhaling through walls. Interesting mechanic, isn't it? Hell, I actually never knew you can do this because, uh, well, the game, the game never does, makes you do this, so, yeah. So, let's hurry up, hurry up, and let's go through this. Okay, we're almost done. I think this is the last room area. Yeah, this is the last room over here, yeah. Because you have to go through this area. And such. Go down here, which pretty much activates this iron ball area, which I'm gonna miss a lot of coins on because I haven't memorized all well, the coins you can find here and such, so aw. But you pretty much bounce on this ball for a couple moments. And grab some coins along the way too. And only one minute left. Hurry, hurry. And we wanna go up here because you need the foot the foot here in order to do this section. Now this section is pretty tricky, so you have to be good on your platforming skills and such, even though I'm not, you know, I'm playing on. Okay, come on. Okay, no, no. Ah, oh, freak, I screwed up. Whatever. Oh, wait, we can't try it again. Ah. Oh. Whatever. I just go through here. See how goofy did, and then I'll do another try on camera. <coughs> this is definitely not gold, I'll tell you that. You know, it looks like it's gold, it's not gold. <laughs> See? See, that's what we need for gold. A lot of, a lot of shenanigans. So let's do this again. I'm gonna do it on camera again because I wanna see how well I do with this. So, try numero dos. Let's uh, go. We. Do 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 Boing! Boing! No, oh, crud! Uh, I want to try to an all one. Yeah, but I almost did it. Almost. That's the keyword, almost. 
Keep on moving, keep on moving, keep on moving. Uh, sorry if I'm being a little quiet in this area, but I'm trying to concentrate right now because I want to get gold, even or even better, even the platinum. If I could a lot really die get platinum on this. It'd be kind of cool though if I could if I did though. I'll admit. And try rewarding out of this power. Hurry, hurry. Okay, good. Good, we got kill that dude. Now we got to try this area again. This is a pretty tricky area. Okay, we did it, we did it, we did it, good, good, good. Man, this part was always tricky. Oh no, crap, missed a coin. Leave no coin behind, especially a silver coin. Uh, okay, okay, we're at the easy section. Well, easiest part of this of this challenge. All I do is master your jumps and you pretty much get everything. Yeah. All through here. Wait, we got all them goodies. Okay, I'll try and miss one. Okay, go up here. Go through here. And we have the thing I was telling you about. That's a pretty easy solution if you think about it. I mean, you know. Go here, inhale that through. Grab that and grab this. Grab all those and grab all these shenanigans and hooray! We're at 20, 20 points so far, just in the level. Not too shabby, I'll admit, although we still have a lot more level to go, so we can't take any breaks yet. No breaks allowed, and I think you can't jump up there normally, so. Well, we have to wait for that thing to come down at me and such. No! no. Ah, crud, I missed the coins. Whatever, 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 whatever. Just keep on rolling! Let's go! Never stop till the end! No, no, no! Oh, foot, foot nuggets! Oh, crud, crud, crud. Crud, I screwed us up. Ah, <sighs> wonderful, wonderful, freaking fantastic. Oh, uh, let's just do one more try on camera. And if I botch this one up, I'll just gonna cut till I get a good score. But you pretty much seen what this item is already, so, yeah. One more failure, and it's. I ain't mean, you know what this game's already asking for it. I'll see you when I do better in this challenge. Hello everyone, I am back and look what I got. I finally got a gold medal in this stinking thingamabobber. Jesus Christ, I'm like a bazillion tries, but I finally did it. This is probably the hardest challenge actually, so just letting you know that, so expect to spend a lot of time in this, and the pro tips aren't really that cool, although they tell you this now, which is pretty cool, I guess. That one's like, no duh, and this is how you learn about platinum. Oh, they don't tell you how, but that's platinum. So, as you see here, we have pretty much cleared all the challenge rooms, and we have a nice shiny medal in this one too. So we're done with challenge rooms. Hooray! Finished all of you stinging bummers. Now why don't we go talk to Magalar before I close off this pretty short video? Off to the man. Hmm, sounds like a certain game that everyone likes for friends. Eh, I don't know. Ruling, rule the universe. Why would Mangler want something that wants to rule the universe? I don't know, sell on eBay something for a humongous prices and I don't know, get it better? Second lore, star cutter. Well, anyway, 
enough of that. That was that should be do for today, even though I think today is a really short video. In the next part, we're gonna be doing the final part of this game. I'm serious, final part of the game, so Hello everyone, welcome to probably the last few videos of Kirby Turn Dream on Extra Mode. My cover Kazi In last episode, we have taken on the, the final ch challenge mode of the game. I am challenge. And we got a gold medal in it. In this episode, we're gonna be doing the last leg of the game. What do you mean? I'm serious, we are doing the last leg of the game. I mean, we're like so close to the end of the game, I can almost inhale it and eat it all. And we have the boss stage. But, um, oh my god, I'm so stupid. I'm not sure if the abilities that they gave you in the boss stage are really good, so I'm just gonna go over here and see what abilities they have to offer here. Um, let's see what ability is a unique ability I haven't used at all. Hmm. Um, sorry, I'm real quiet. I'm trying to think here. Um, you know what? As cheap as this is. We're bringing on the hammer time. I don't know. I could use like leaf or something, but I really don't know any other ability I can think of. Tommy head I can use right now that I already haven't used in a major boss battle, excluding those Doomer fights. But anyway, after you must delay, unfortunately. Sorry, guys. Um, I don't know why I didn't plan this well, but if you probably notice, I'm actually recording a lot of episodes today. I recorded. A Three episodes already because I'm make so much fun with this game and I'm not getting better time to record so I might as well do this so let's do the final part of the game oh my god I could almost taste the end of this game I mean I'm serious I'm like enemies right now and he get a lot of abilities here too so yay but that was probably the stupidest thing I ever done other than saying no to a girl I am so stupid. I got rid of hammer. I'm a genius, you know. Um, BRB. Alright, guys, I am back after that humongously stupid failure. That's probably the most epic fail I ever had ever since that stage 2 of the game, but whatever. Anyway, let's just ignore it and let's just go through this door before I start crying. Oh, interesting scenery, I have to admit. Hey, it's a dragon! It's, it's, it's a po Generation 3 Pokemon! I forgot what his name is called, but whatever. What's this? He, he, oh snaps, things are going down now. Um, this is Landia, EX mode. Landia EX mode? Well, it's EX version. What do you expect from him? Um, can it please hit you? There we go. Oh shoot, watch out for this attack. Watch out for his tail whip. It's super effective. And he's gonna swoop down on you and shenanigans. Hey, hammer should be a pretty good weapon for his battle, I admit. Then again, hammer makes everything easy at all. Stupid Landia. Using flamethrower. Jesus Christ. Hold oh, still, you stupid thing. Oh, when he's halfway dead, well, not halfway dead, one fourth way, he. Split into four! Now in this area, well, when the EX what he does this has his good attack at the void. Well then I think they just do hammer and then they pretty much avoid it. When you win this mode, no we not answer. In this battle, when you put this phase, you want to, uh, to attack the dude with the crown because the dude the crown takes the most damage. So we can attack the other one, but they don't do as much damage, so just focus your attacks on the main dude. Oh shoot ah. Uh, Okay, watch out for this attack too, because he's gonna do that. And I think now they're just gonna swoop at you now. Okay, crud. Stop losing hammer. Okay. Oh crud, this is... Oh yeah, we beat him! Hooray! We won the game, folks! And he de-evolved. I knew that was possible. And, um, no dance? Okay. Oh, we have a cutscene. Let's watch. The Master Crown. I'm pretty sure that's not a ripoff from another uh, very cool RPG series that involves swords and axes and whatnot and what?
Look at you, you spins, that's so hilarious. Like, Wah! Well, he's a jerk. I would say something else, but uh, just to make this uh, PG-13 uh, and such, I'm not gonna say it, so... And look! We have our own little dragon now! And apparently Dee Dee never seen a dragon before because he's like, Oh, what this I see here? Yeah, Dee Dee Dee! Ride that dragon! Ride that dragon! That sounds really disgusting, but I'm not gonna say anything else. So let's chase after this stupid traitor that resembles a, a really another thing about from another game. 